Hi, I'm Michael Wolf, and I'm going to talk a little bit about the blues. A lot of students ask me, you know, what's going on with the blues and jazz, you know? I mean, there's a regular blues 12-bar form that's... flat back to two bars of the one F. a bar of the five C seven and B flat seven back to the one that's sort of a basic blues the way I learned it but in jazz and bebop you can do a million different things a million chord substitutions sometimes I don't even know what I'm doing it's just kind of all going on at once but there are a lot of fun things to do just to make movement happen. So if I'm going, uh, instead of four bars on the one, I might do the one, then go to the four and back to the one. So let's try that. To the four, card four bar. Now we know the next, we got the third bar. The, we're going to have one more bar to go, and then we're going to end up on bar five. B flat is usually the four chords where you want to end up. So maybe I would do a 2-5 into B flat. So a 2-5 in the key of B flat is C minor 7 to F7. And then we would go to that. So sometimes you can put a 2-5 into another chord. So let's do that again. The four chord. Now 2-5 would be flat. C minor. F7. The four chord. Going back to the 1. Let's do a 2-5 in the 1. G minor to C is a 2-5 in the 1. Instead of doing 5-4, a lot of times the judge go 2, 2 minor, 2-5, two and then 1. So we'll do that. So let's take it from the top. It's kind of a cool jazz way to do that. So the 1 chord, the 4 chord, the 4 bar. Do a 2-5 to get to that 4 chord. 4 chord. 2-5 to the 1. Now the other thing you might want to do is you might want to go from your one chord to the six chord to the two chord to the five, what's called a turnaround. You could do a turnaround in any kind of music, whether it's rhythm changes or standards or whatever. So let's just say we get to that, uh, we do that from the top. Four chord. Is you can do minor sevenths or dominant sevenths on any of these chords. It works out fine. Let's just say now you can work backwards to anywhere you want to go. So let's just say we're trying to get to this B flat on the second bar. So we could do a whole bar of one like I'm doing. Or we could start out and go actually 2-5 of B flat. It's a little awkward but not bad. So let's start with the one chord. To the two, four chord, back to the one chord. Now we're gonna do the two five to get to the B flat. Four chord. Now I'm gonna go to an E flat seven flat seven to the one chord. I just like that. Now I'm gonna go down uh, to the B four chord. The three, the six, now two. Now I'm gonna do a three six two five. So there are a million things you can do. Well, I can take one bar, how about this? F for a bar. E minor seven for two beats to A seven. D minor to G. Because I know I like this is a long way to get to the B flat on the fifth bar, right? So one, two, three, bar two. Bar three, bar four. Now get to
do, there's a thing called tritone substitutions. That's a whole other thing to talk about. Basically, instead of an F, I can always do the chord a tritone way. Because if you have a root, C, an F7, you have the third and the seventh. You're going to have A and, and uh, E flat. Well, if you use those same notes and put the tritone away, the B, uh, away from that, the B in the root, the, the third of the F becomes the seventh of that, and the seventh becomes the third. So you can always substitute that different bass note. So it just gives you something else to do. doing C7, C minor 7 to F, you could go instead of the C, G flat to B. So there are a million different things you can do on the blues, and it's just fun to do, and it just depends on the style that you want to do it. You also don't have to play any changes, you can just play like, like a fast blues and F. Like. experiment and you have to find this on your own. That's what's so great about jazz. You have these ideas and I want you to sit down, write it out on a piece of paper. F7 for four bars, B flat for two bars, F7 for two bars, and C7 for two bars, or C7 for a bar, B flat for a bar, F7, and then just start filling it in. It's like a puzzle. It's all like a puzzle. And then pretty soon you'll find what you like and then you'll just start playing it and you'll be able to play it in all the keys.